my daughter Michaela Callahan is five foot four. She has brown hair that's uh, a little over shoulder length. She has brown eyes and she weighs about 150 pounds. She's wearing a, a, lo a long blue jeans, uh, a multicolored short sleeve shirt, and um, sandals, brown sandals. And we were traveling from Modesto up to Bremerton, Washington. Uh, we had just moved my son-in-law down there because he got a new teaching job and we stopped in uh, Reading because we were tired and we just spent the night. We got here about 9.30, 10 o'clock and, um, and then we were going to head the next morning early and head on out to Bremerton. Well, that evening we uh, stopped at um, Subway, got a sandwich and then came up here and ate it in the room and um, then we watched a movie and uh, I mean TV and um, my son-in-law went to bed early about 1130 and I, we went to bed and finished the movie at 12 o'clock and um, lights out and, and sleeping and the next thing I knew uh, I had to go to the bathroom so I got up and I noticed that the door was uh, cra cracked o over here and my uh, so I knew my son-in-law had locked it because I asked him to do that and watched him get up and do that and I went to the bath and pushed the door I thought that was kind of strange I went to the bathroom came back out and noticed that my daughter was not laying in the bed and uh, then I uh, immediately told my son-in-law get up we need to look for Michaela she's not here and uh, so we quickly looked up and down the hallways quickly ran outside I let the people in the front know and then um, when we didn't come up with it, then immediately I asked them to dial 911 so I could call. And so they did that up in the front office and um, soon after the police came and um, I went ahead and told the detective after that, you know, uh, we tried to, I, I got in the car and I couldn't sleep but I went and we went up and down the streets and all the streets that we could that you think of down and around Safeway. And, you know, all the restaurants and everything, and, and couldn't find her, came back here, and then, you know, waited. You know, waited to hear her. That was what we were told, that the, they were gonna, uh, the police were going to call us back, and they hadn't done that, so um, we went from there, right? You know, we've been we've been to the hospital, both hospitals to check on and see if she's been there. Benny Jane Doe came in there. We've been going to Costco's, and we've been, uh, got lots of pictures there. Like I said, the lady there was very helpful. When we just called her, she's printed off a bunch of pictures and they were ready for us. And we've gone around walking up and down the streets and distributing them to different hotels. We have other, uh, uh, the church here, local Seventh-day Adventist church is coming and they're passing out, uh, been passing out uh, pictures of her and that to uh, area hotels and other people, homes that are around in the area and stuff. Um, and, you know, just getting stuff that we need, you know, to do all this stuff.